It's a beautiful morning. It's a wonderful day. It's a beautiful day. I'm Pastor Johnny. Greetings, dearly beloved. I want to speak to you today about the guidance of the Holy Spirit in soul winning. The Holy Spirit is so involved in soul winning. In fact, without His conviction, we cannot lead somebody to Christ. You will just find yourself winning arguments and not winning the soul. Let's look at what Jesus said about the Holy Spirit helping us and being with us. Look with me at Luke chapter 12 and verse 11. Now when they bring you to the synagogues and magistrates and authorities, do not worry about how or what you should answer or what you would say. For the Holy Spirit will teach you in that very hour what you ought to say. Just the fact of being available to the Holy Spirit in soul winning. Every morning on my way to work, I pray, Lord, give me an opportunity today. Make me a soul winner today. I thank you for the opportunity. And it's amazing. The anointing on you brings conviction to those around you. They'll often start acting up. They'll often start making excuses for what they do. You said nothing, but they're making excuses. What is that? That's the conviction of the Holy Spirit. And so Jesus said, don't worry about what you would say. But as the Holy Spirit convicts them, they start talking about things. Then you simply hone in on the very thing. And you speak to them. And you talk to them about how Jesus can save them from their sin. How Jesus saved you from your sin. And that is the point of conviction. For salvation, there needs to be a point of conviction. And it's the Holy Spirit working. What a triumph that you and I can work with the Holy Spirit today. And He's going to confirm His word with signs and wonders. He's going to confirm His word with supernaturally touching those people's hearts. Today, dearly beloved, I believe with you that those who you've been trusting God for in your workplace... The Holy Spirit's going to open those doors and as you speak into their lives, you're going to see a miracle harvest. May the Lord bless you. May souls come to the kingdom today. Let the hand of God rest on you. Remember, the Spirit will teach you Himself in that same hour what you will say. I bless you, ministers of the Holy Ghost, as you win souls for the Lord today. Amen. Amen.